Welcome to another update for the Force of 13. In this update, uh, we look at Invest 96W, where the Joy Typhoon Warning Centre has issued a tropical cyclone alert for this system. The JTWC says that a cyclone could form either side of the line from 18 decimal 2 degrees north 113 decimal 1 degrees east to 23 north 113 decimal 7 degrees east and it's about 220 nautical miles south southwest of Hong Kong animated and enhanced infrared satellite imagery and a uh, microwave image depicted consolidated by still elongated uh, low level circulation with convection uh, confined to the rest of the center. Maximum winds displaced about 100 nautical miles from the center. Vertical wind shear is low to moderate, 5 to 15 knots, but increases sharply to the south. Uh, here's the Joy Typhoon Warning Center's uh, current track chart on the system. It increases sharply to the south. Upper level divergence in easterly flow is also weak. Sea surface temperature in the South China Sea remains favorable at 28 to 30 Celsius. Global models are in strong agreement at 96W will consolidate over the next 24 hours with some spread in near-term track solution generally moving with a northward component maximum sustained service winds estimated at 18 to 23 knots minimum sea level pressure is estimated to be around the 999 millibars now here's a look at the NOAA floaters and the Vietnamese uh, weather office has upgraded 96. This is uh, from monitoring their own website. Uh, 96W, uh, as far as their concern, is now a tropical depression. And here's the current chart on the tropical depression. Potential for the development of a significant tropical cyclone within the 24 hours is high. That's the latest from the Joint Typhoon Warning Centre on Invest 96W. Tropical tidbits and a couple of models when viewing non-official weather sources, caution needs to be applied because the information does change. And if you have a look at our previous live streaming uh, event from earlier this morning, uh, there's additional information. And from my own personal position, and it's again the steering mechanisms, but this uh, system is one that and I need to be kept on, along with uh, Tropical Storm Ayami. And Pivotal Weather website has uh, precipitation rainfall scale bottom of the screen and it's the GFS model. What I look for is the area in yellow through to dark brown. Total precipitable water, and you can clearly see uh, Hurricane uh, Hector and X Shanahan. Uh, 
and uh, we Shanahan and located 164 nautical miles northeast of the Noita Airport tracking east northeast at 8 knots over the last 6 hours. Joint Typhoon Warning Center has finalized their position. Now we have a look at upper level divergence around 20 to 30 knots. The latest wind shear. The environment for uh, Shanahan, or it's Apology, Shan Shan, Tropical Storm, Yagi, and the Tropical Tear Pressure 96W is fairly good. The shear tendency you can clearly see where the systems are. The 850 millibar vorticity, this one clearly defines where the three systems are. We still have 97W. And here's a look at a model and you can clearly see the three uh, systems. And with the now remnants of Shan Shan, here's another look at its life. Force 13 appreciates the support across the various uh, platforms. Uh, we will continue to bring the latest information across all systems and information indicates that we will be going live again around the same, same time Friday. And Chen Chan is definitely on a weakening trend and here's a final look at the late cycle intensity guidance. You can follow Force 13's outlets, the website force13.com, which has had a revamp and is still under reconstruction, but take a look. Also, YouTube, of course, if you haven't subscribed, that might be a good idea. Visit Force 13. We're also on Facebook under the same name, of course, and you can like us on there, and you can also follow us on Twitter. Search Force 13 all in text for those. You can also add Force 13 on Skype or my personal account on Discord, Fool13, at extension 9094.